Well, Nebraska adds another commitment from the state of Texas. Hi, Sean Callahan of Husker Online. Before we get to that, make sure you give our page here a like. Let's get this video a like as well and get it over 500 likes. But Nebraska adds now their second verbal commitment for the class of 2023 from the state of Texas, from linebacker Dylan Rogers out of Cypress, Texas, Cy Woods High School. Um, you look at the process with him, really came down, I believe, to Missouri, Nebraska. You had Houston, you had Texas, you had Louisville in there as well, um, but came in for his official visit a week ago, visited Missouri here this past week, and uh, made it official and committed to the Huskers as Nebraska uh, adds a commitment from Dylan Rogers. He's the second verbal commitment now, as I mentioned, from the state of Texas. That hasn't happened for the Huskers since the year 2020 when they signed Will Nixon and Omar Manning. And Omar Manning is obviously out of a junior college um, that year, um, but two recruits that year from the state of Texas. It just hasn't been as fruitful of a state for Nebraska in a lot of ways over the years. The last time they took three in one year was Brendan Hymas, Deontay Watts, and Damian Daniels back in 2017. But you're seeing a strong push in the state of Texas for the Huskers. I think a lot of it has to do with the addition of Brian Applewhite. He came from TCU. He's got the connections and the contacts down there. It's really made a push down in Texas that we haven't seen from Nebraska in a number of years where they now have what appears to be a much more consistent presence and some contacts and connections that have been able to get a lot of visitors here on campus. And getting Dylan Rogers, I think, shows that as he joins Riley Van Poppel as the other member of the, uh, of the 2023 recruiting class from the state of Texas. And once again, make sure you give our YouTube channel here a like and a follow, as well as our Husker Online podcast channel. For HuskerOnline.com, I'm Sean Callahan.